this is um, this is the Scottish Rite Freemason building in Santa Fe, and as you can see, uh, it looks very Moorish. The whole thing's kind of This is the famous Loretta Chapel. This is the building inside of which there's the uh, so-called Miracle Staircase. Um, so this is the smaller of the two chapels that we have um, in the middle of Santa Fe. And you can see these later additions are all adobe. And in fact, they stuck with this wall here, but the rest of it is stone. Some of it quite ornate. Some of it uh, appears to be different. Like you can see these two. This one looks different from these, right? Um, also, these ones. Now, there's a few things here. Check this out. I don't know if you can see this, but the detail on this little thing up here is insane. It's all spongified. I'm not sure if I can capture that. Exactly. My phone does not want to focus anymore. But uh, I'll try to post a picture, but the detail on that thing up there is ridiculous. Uh, but yeah, as far as this part goes, it just looks like every other chapel and anywhere else. Sorry I can't show you the inside right now, but I want to show you the outside. Oh, by the way, in this window, we have an Alpha and an Omega, and the uh, Pax Romana. Let's keep looking. detail on these windows. Okay, here again you can see, this might be nothing, but it stands out to me. This is a little bit different, this guy, than this guy. See, one has lots of tool marks on it, the other one doesn't. I don't know if that means anything. Most of these are pretty consistent, actually. can see inside here, this doorway, this little building that we're poking through the window of here, it's um, new, but this, you can see stone on there too, is a little miniature of the staircase. This place is closed right now, so it's the best we can do, but check it out. You can see the burn marks as from a direct in energy weapons, lasers and stuff, medieval lasers. See that medieval laser damage right there? 
Look at that. Meltage. That's that's meltage. Tell me that's not meltage. It actually does look a little weird, not gonna lie. This is the only column that has anything like this going on. This is at the very rearmost uh, part of the chapel. Uh, behind a fence. So that is actually kind of interesting because none of the other ones... Uh, this just looks like erosion, but this darkened stuff is kind of weird looking actually. Alright, so that's where that column is over there. This is the very back. Okay, so this is something. A little dark spot there. Across two bricks. I don't know. Somebody tell me what that is. This is, um. What do you think that is? black spot up there. Anything else? I guess now that we're looking, we might as well look. That's just paint. There's another one of these things. Maybe this is just concrete stuff. Yeah, there are actually are quite a few of these weird little black spots, like these things. Huh. I mean, I don't know. Once again, this is the Loretto Chapel, famous because it's got the miracle staircase inside. Um, but this is what the outside of this building looks like. Um, so we're gonna go check out the other one um, that's just around the corner over that way. You can see like the front of the building here has these uh, bricks, and uh, the rest of the building has stucco in between the pillars. So I'm not sure if it's stucco all the way. So this is a pretty nice door, dude. The door in the back, I didn't get a picture of that, but it kind of looks like this too. Oh. Yeah, pretty standard building there. Another thing I'm noticing is that there's this um, red brick wall thing going around a pretty big area surrounding this building and while this might not be significant at all, it is pretty big and it does surround the area. Okay, so yeah. That church is right there. See it? Here's the other one. And by the way, that's that red brick wall just between. Okay, so this building's bigger. Quite a bit bigger. Um, you'll notice, I've noticed anyway, that there's a little bit of a discrepancy between the um, bricks that are used at the bottom and the bricks that are used at the top. Um, so who knows what kind of remodeling has gone down here, but you can pretty much see already they had the little Moorish thing going on in the windows here. Yeah. Some more scarring on the walls there. Oh, 
dudes with mustaches, flowers, some other thing. These are like different. Moorish stuff there. Same little rose windows. Huh. Pretty gigantic building, to be honest. It says, in honor of the original settlers of Santa Fe buried here. Yeah, this is about twice as big as the other one. Pretty grand building, considering the scale of, you know, everything else in Santa Fe is made out of fucking mud, you know, stuff like this, like this, and you have, boom, Notre Dame, so it's pretty interesting. Uh, okay, so here you can see a clear difference between old architecture, new architecture, and yet, there appears to be some of these same stained glass windows in this apparently newer building at the rear. And by the way, here's this big church, and then this very strange building here, which is uh, brick. And you have this weird thing. This is like way at the back here. Uh, it's like got metal shoved into it. It's all cracking apart. <laughs> Just that one. Yeah, you can see back here um, the construction gets a little weird and it looks like they're using um... like sheets of rock and these look weird and out of place I don't know what it is but these these look like and then like up there look at this yeah this is weird it looks like they had like extra shit and they just kind of tacked it on there like look at the back up there that brick pattern and then it's just like not above the window there and it just stops right there that's kind of weird. Um, see here they have one of these stained glass things just kind of like in a box on the back here. And um, uh, it's kind of weird, out of place. So it looks like they had extra stained glass windows at some point. might be new yeah reproductions maybe I mean I don't know it's pretty weird so um, this is the back of the building um, I don't know if you can even see it yeah I can kind of see it if I go like that okay so yeah you see it's kind of weird they just got all these like this is like new, new stuff where like a good part of it they stuck these like sheets of, I don't know what the fuck this is, it's not concrete, 
or it's weird concrete. And then it just goes right to concrete here. It's like they ran out, look at this. So this stuff, and then this is totally just like stucco, so listen. Okay, so they ran out here, and then they have more at the edge. And then even over here, this side looks newer. Then I'm, I guess what I'm wondering is if they rebuilt this stuff with like shit they had laying around or something. So this stuff looks totally different. This style of window, completely different. These stones aren't flat on the surface. But it kind of looks like the same stuff. Now here's this again. Now we have the old windows again. Or the old style. There's probably people who know how to make this stuff. Around here. Historic Cathedral St. Francis Assisi. 1610. Look at that. Present church built in 1886. Interesting, okay. Well, here we are. All right. The top, this stuff is like a little different than everything else too. It's like a little bit brighter. This is what I was saying. There's kind of a discrepancy between the rocks at the bottom and the rocks at the top. And I'm going to show you the front one more time so you can kind of see a little more what I'm talking about. Yeah, red brick wall. There's the church. Okay, you see that? See how there's like a little thing going on there? And then look up there on the corner. And then look up there. You see? They're a little different. buildings that uh, look like this around here everything else is kind of like this you know so it obviously stands out pretty hard um, but yeah, there's that one so most everything they kind of have this shit going on and then there's this building up here which is a little different, and it also kind of stands out. I'll show you what I'm talking about. It's the only one like this. Uh, besides, I guess, that one. Yeah, we're not looking for ancient, guys just looking for out of place and I'm not saying this building is out of place but this building has always caught my attention for some reason I have been up there um, this could be shaped concrete and at a distance it doesn't look that crazy but when you get up close to it it actually looks pretty nice this face is again. Look at that guy, he looks mean. That one's smiling, that one's angry, that one's sad, that one's sticking out his tongue. See that? Literally. Monument in the middle here. Some of you might remember all that crazy shit that was going on in 2020 and a bunch of people 
decided they were gonna pull down this obelisk. And the, t the town decided, you know what? We'll just throw up some hardy backer, paint it tan, leave it there, call it good, and then put this fucking sign up and just for forget about it. Doesn't have anything to do with the video, but I thought I'd throw that in there for you guys because this shit is so cucked. It's unbelievable. But yeah, let's move on. So one thing I do want to point out is that although a lot of this stuff has uh, Adobe stucco, fake, fake Adobe stucco on it, um, we actually can kind of tell that at one point this place looked like uh, any other any other American town plaza, the same shit that you see in Texas. Um, it looked the same. Everything was uh, bricks, and I'll show you in a minute how you can tell. Um, but even that building we were just showing you a second ago, uh, you can see see at the at the at the ground level they made it, uh, they stuccoed it, and at the top it's bricks. But I'm going to show you uh, right there. You can see some bricks and stuff. But I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. So one thing I do want to point out is that although a lot of this stuff has uh, Adobe stucco, fake fake Adobe stucco on it, um, we actually can kind of tell that at one point. This place looked like uh, any other, any other American town plaza. The same shit that you see in Texas. Um, it looked the same. Everything was uh, bricks, and I'll show you in a minute how you can tell. Um, but even that building we were just showing you a second ago, uh, you can see see at the at the at the ground level they made it. Uh, they stuccoed it, and at the top it's bricks. But I'm going to show you. Well, right there you can see some bricks and stuff, but I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. Like this, for example, you can see regular bricks, stuff that you would see pretty much anywhere. Oh, and even like it's uh, kind of looking a little bit like Paris, Texas up there, isn't it? So that's just um, one of the walls that's exposed like that, but there's actually a bunch of these around here. I'll try to get them real quick. You guys an idea of why I'm including this. Um, this catches my eye because you look around here, you see all this kind of stuff, you know? You think, oh, it's it's always been like this. And uh, Taos is the same way. They kind of make it seem like it's just always been that way. But you can actually um, look up old photographs of Taos. And although there were many people building their houses out of mud, the actual town um, of Taos, downtown, it looked, uh, just like anywhere else, uh, any other, you know, American town, clapboard and bricks and stuff, and then they decided, um, we're going to make everything look Spanish Revival, they call it. Yeah, there's some bricks over there, a big brick building, another brick building there, you're gonna see a big one as we turn this corner. Um, but yeah, again, why this is interesting to me is um, <clears throat> mostly just because they're trying to act like things have always looked like this. Um, and uh, for whatever reason, all at once, they made a stylistic uh, decision to uh, kind of change everything. Uh, yeah, here's this place, just as an example. The Pizza Gallery weird choice there of the name it says they're open so again guys um, this is not ancient we're not talking about ancient stuff we're looking for weird stuff this building looks new actually this one here this doesn't look very old I mean I could be wrong but anyway um, yeah, we're not looking for um, ancient stuff. We're looking for uh, lies in the history and uh, hasty, hasty cover-ups, I think. At the end of the day, what we're really looking for are uh, hasty cover-ups that expose um, holes in the story. If we're trying to say yeah, history's a lie, etc. Um, we're looking for things that 
don't fit in. So is there anything too crazy about the fact that this place looked like everywhere else and then one day all of a sudden they decided we're going to make everything uh, tan and stucco. Um, I don't know. I don't know uh, what that would, how that would benefit them that much, but, uh, you know, there might be something to that. I think this whole thing was brick and then they stuccoed it. I'm pretty sure. Um, why I'm looking at this building is because um, this is actually this crazy theater. Um, I don't know that this building's old at all, but I haven't actually looked. Uh, it's got some dragons up there. Some uh, interesting windows. I think this is called the Lensic. Yeah, it's actually not too hard um, to imagine. Uh, all this stuff looking like, uh, especially look down here, just every other fucking town in America. And then they just stuccoed it, painted it brown. But yeah, here's this. I'm not sure this is old. It kind of doesn't look that old, but another feature. A lot of these buildings still just have brick at the top. Uh, so, so, yeah. <laughs> and that one's brick. That one's brick. I mean, we're just doing a quick r walk around, guys. I don't have, uh, I don't have that much time or energy to do the whole entire place. But then up there, you can see that tower. That's the uh, Capitol building or whatever. It's got some gold at the top. Looks pretty sick. I don't know that it's old, but it's pretty cool. Hey, look at that. Hey, mud flood. My fuck. Or like, how the fuck, how did you, how the fuck did, bro, bro.